Now I already know that you've already noticed that everybody and their grandmother has been wearing these Gucci fur prints and mules. Mules have been such a huge, huge fashion trend. Spring 2017, every major shoe company, every store carries mules. But the Gucci ones, yes, they're cute. Yes, every rich person has to have some Gucci slippers with fur. But at the $1,000 price tag, that's unreachable to a lot of people. So we are going to take these $80 Steve Madden shoes, which I got for 25% off. I'll put the discount code down below in the description box. We're going to take these $80 Steve Madden loafers, and we are going to put some fur on here. You do need some type of fur, the fur of your choice, color of your choice. I actually just got two different colors and I'm going to mix them, you'll see in a second. So I got like a light tan and a darker tan. Um, it comes off a little bit yellow on camera. You also need a pair of scissors and you need some E6000 fabric glue. Now according to the Gucci.com website, the fur that they use on their mules is 100% real goat fur. Now I ain't got no 100% real goat fur, but I do have this dollar store craft fur. And we gonna make it do what it do. So I'm just gonna basically start off by measuring the fur on the inner part of the shoe and then cutting it, as you can see here. Next, I'm going to grab my E6000 glue and saturate the bottom of this shoe with that glue. I'm kind of making this stuff as I go. So next I am basically going to measure the, the top of the shoe. And I want some fur to come out the top of it. So I'm going to measure that and then I'm going to fold it. And then I'm going to just glue it on the top. I'm going to do the same with the sides of the shoe as well. So I'm just going to measure it, cut it, fold it, glue it, and then glue it down. Now obviously this is not going to look like the exact Gucci shoe, so do not come for me in my comments. This is just a quick disclaimer.
now that I'm all done, this fur is looking really, really, really scary. So I'm just going to take my scissors and I'm going to just trim it a little bit because this fur is not what I expected. My mother said it looks like rat fur and that is not the look I was going for. So I'm basically going to take my scissors and trim it a little bit because they are too long. If you are trying to do this style, I would definitely suggest ordering a size larger, a half size larger, um, because since you are putting fur on the back of your shoe, where your heel is supposed to be, your heel might hang over, which isn't a good look. So you want to make sure that because that extra fur is in the back, that your foot sits inside the shoe. So just order a half size larger. As always, I appreciate you watching this video and I thank you all for the support. Please let me know if you have any questions at all. Leave them down below in the comment section. I would love to see you all in my next video. Bye guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs>